Okay, having a bit of an issue here. Just built up this system with the Core 2 Quad. It's basically just parts I had laying around. I'm even throwing in like three DVD drives I'm not using just to sell them off as one big lot kind of thing. Only issue is, powering up, you get a long continuous beat. And no idea why. Uh, at first I thought it was the 260 I have here. Nope. I tried putting in this GT520. And it's doing that. I thought it was just USB thing being all plugged up wrong because as you can see, it's all different cables and confusing and dumb like that. But I don't know. It still gives me the beep error code of long and continuous. I am unsure why it does this. It could be the fan there, so I will unplug that and put in a slower memory stick into the farthest memory card slot since that's usually the default and or most compatible one. Alright, if you're wondering, the motherboard model is whatever that is. Have fun with that. No beeps. It did restart though. Okay. Okay, shut up. That's going somewhere. So get this stupid son of a gun back plugged in there. There we go. Will you display anything? Oh. Okay, undoing this fan seems to have done something. Well, display though. Mm, come on, you can do it. All right, well, it's powered up for more than two seconds and not peeping, but it's not displaying video now. And it's not posting. Okay, I threw the 260 in there now and plugged it up. Will you do anything? Okay, the 260 is pushing out air at full speed. Why? Hmm. Okay, I've gone ahead and disconnected the front fan. Maybe in combination with the graphics card. The fan can't handle it, or the computer can't handle it. Oh, I shut it off. Cool. Alright. It's shut down now. Reboot it again. The fans come back on.
Right? It's not giving me any beep codes anymore. So in theory it should be good, but the uh, stupid monitor won't detect a thing. This may sound stupid, but it doesn't need a keyboard. Let's try that. Keyboard acquired. Let's try this now in a different memory card in a different slot now. Okay, now it's just immediately... Okay. It's just... Okay. Oh, yes. Okay. Discrete failure. Okay, this speaker is annoying. So, shut up. Control, Alt, Delete. Is it like that? But yeah, okay. Okay. I have done something. So everything is actually gone and good. What happens if I install all the memory cards again? Okay, with everything hooked back up except for the 520, how will it fare? Will it immediately explode and shut down? Give, well, I unplugged the speaker so it won't beep. Yay, it's fixed. Um, <laughs> I honestly have no idea what I did. It must have been the keyboard. Now it wants me to set a parade, and it's detecting the hard drive, alright. Um, that was the issue before. None of the connections down there, like old IDE or SATA, would would work. Like, it would set up Windows, set up the Windows thing, okay. But the Windows um, startup screen would keep loading forever and ever and ever. Like, it would say starting Windows forever, like nights at a time. It would not end. No idea why, but yeah. I guess that's how you fix something dumb like this. Reshoot the memory and give it a keyboard, I guess. That's the only issue I actually found. The only other issue could be as I plugged these in wrong, but I'm gonna not bother with that. So I guess if you enjoyed, please like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. Thanks, game we out, see you next time.